Here's how to use MindGrasp's Q&A feature to completely streamline your entire research process. So first I'm just going to start by uploading a research paper that I'm interested in learning more about. Now once that's done processing, you can head over to the Q&A feature, which basically gives you the ability to actually talk to your documents and to your research papers. So I'm just going to start by asking it to give me an analogy to explain EMDR therapy. And there we go, in just a few seconds, it gave me a perfect analogy to give me a better understanding of the main topic of the research paper. I'm then going to actually ask it to make me a study guide from this research paper. And in just a few seconds, it gave me a perfectly structured study guide for me to review my understanding. Now, if I'd like to expand on my research a little bit more, there's a really cool feature over here called the Search the Web, which basically gives MindGrasp the ability to actually connect to the internet. So we're just going to toggle that on. And then I'm going to ask it to search the web to find me other studies that have been conducted that support EMDR therapy. So what this is going to do is just basically scour the web and find me other studies that have similar findings to the research paper that I've just uploaded. And so if we just scroll up, there we go. It just gave me a summary of all the studies that have been conducted that are in support of EMDR therapy. And what's really cool is it also provides me with a list of references, or in other words, the links that it used to actually construct this answer over here. And what's even cooler is that these links are even clickable. So I can just click on this. And there we go. It just found me this study that has similar findings to the research paper that I've uploaded. Now, what a lot of people don't actually know is that if you just go back here, you can actually use MindGrasp's AI system without actually uploading any files to begin with. So this can essentially act as your own personal search engine. So if I'm writing my research paper on this, I can toggle on search the web again and then ask it to find me primary resources from the founder of EMDR therapy explaining how they discovered it. And there we go. So instead of scouring the internet trying to find a specific answer, it just gave it to me in a few seconds and it provided me with the links once again. And so this way I do not have to worry about the credibility or reliability of that answer because I have the actual source myself. Now, the great thing about this AI assistant is that it really is tailored to your specific research needs. So for example, I'm going to ask it to find me pieces of research or any testimonials that contradict the effectiveness of EMDR therapy. And there we go. It just gave me some more research that contradicts the effectiveness of EMDR. And again, I can click on this and I can take a closer look at this if I'd like to.